everyone, it's Evangeline right here at E-Trailer and today we'll be taking a look at the Sea Sucker Palavicini Ski and Snowboard Rack here at eTrailer.com. So you want to hit the slopes, but you need to figure out how to get your skis and your snowboards there. Usually people have a roof rack with a roof mounted ski and snowboard carrier and then that's how they carry their skis and snowboards. You could try to put it in your car, but you don't really want to do that. Now, what if you don't have a roof rack, you don't have crossbars, or you aren't able to install some crossbars? That's where the Sea Sucker vacuum cup mounted ski and snowboard carrier can come in handy. Maybe you have a rental, you could just put that right on there. This adheres to metal, glass, and fiberglass and creates that solution so that way you can hit the slopes. This can carry up to four pairs of skis or two snowboards. You also have some slots there for your ski poles. That way everything can stay on top of your roof, but it's also still accessible. Now it is designed to stand up to the elements. As you can see here, we've got a little bit of a snowstorm kicking up. My main question is how will it deal with the cold? Now what it's made of is thermoplastic and that's gonna be okay with the hot or with the cold, your different temperature changes but those vacuum cup mounts. Now those are what people would always wonder about. When it does get cold, does it affect the vacuum? Spoiler alert, it doesn't, but let's take a look. And if you don't trust how the suction is, then there is a quick and easy indicator to see if it is vacuuming properly or not. As long as you don't see any orange indicators, you know that your seal is nice and secure. We're gonna leave this outside for a little bit and see how it does. Drove it around for a little bit, let's check it out. Everything is solid, everything secured, no orange indicators, that's awesome. So you saw how it looks out in the snow, it's a little cold out here, let's take it inside and I'll show you how to install it. So if the first thing before installing is just make sure you have the right roof and that your roof is prepped. Here we have our RAV4, our RAV4 actually has a sunroof, so there's glass up here, and that's okay as long as you mount your carriers to the proper spots. You wanna make sure that there's no ridges, no bumps, no way that air can come through the vacuum, and it's helpful just to clean that surface off with some soapy water. So with your roof clean, you're then just going to take the covers off of your carrier, put it onto your roof wherever you want it to go, we're gonna have it here so it's facing away. You want those pumps facing the back of your vehicle. Fix that into place and let's get the other one. So for spacing, put them as far apart where it makes sense for your bindings to still fit on the inside, but you also still have a firm hold on your skis and your snowboards. So once you figured out what spot you need it to be in, you then just depress this plunger to vacuum it down. So everything is secure. We have our carriers firmly on our roof. Now, if you are concerned about, maybe my roof is a little too textured, will it still work? Well, a good test of that is leave it on there for two hours. If after two hours you see an orange indicator, not gonna be the best fit. But without an orange indicator, you know it's secure there. So to load your skis and snowboards up, Notice the way I have our carriers positioned. I like to have them towards the side of the vehicle to make it easier to access the handles. So you flip the handle up, it takes a little bit of force. There we go. Once that's up, you're able to lift this entire frame off. This can fit up to four pairs of skis. So you do have these little notches in your carrier where your skis can fit into. So it's gonna be the same thing on the other side. And then your third and fourth could fit right up here. So the notch in the middle, that's gonna be for your ski poles. And if you are gonna be using this for your third and fourth pair of skis, just be very careful about how you set them on there. You don't have that much of a ledge, so I would recommend doing this last. Your snowboards go right into the same notch, and that's where you secure it. So once you're happy with how your skis and your snowboards are up there, all you have left to do is to set that frame up and over. So there's a little bit of a trick to it. You wanna make sure that lines up. You can use the handle to pull things down as well. And then push that in, that's secure. 
So for securing your skis, snowboards, and care, you can put a cable lock through the middle hole that secures all of them at the same time. Also with how the handle is designed, you can still use it with thick gloves. It will be a little bit of tension there, so you're gonna have to really use that handle, but it's nice that that's an option. So we saw how to install it. We saw how it works outside in the cold weather. What are my personal thoughts about our ski and snowboard carrier? Well, this is very helpful for maybe you need a rental to get yourself to the ski resort. You can't bring your crossbars with you. You can bring this too. It's still portable enough where you can put it right in your suitcase, in your bag, or in your trunk, and you're ready to hit the road. So if you're already carrying around skis, you're already carrying around snowboards, this makes it a lot easier to do so. Now this does limit you though, because you have your skis and snowboards that are exposed to the elements, or maybe you want the traditional roof-mounted ski and snowboard carrier because those have typically a larger capacity. This can carry a max of four skis or two snowboards. Maybe you need to carry more. We have those options right here at E-Trailer. So whether you need a rooftop cargo box, a slide-out ski and snowboard carrier, or a vacuum cup mounted carrier you can find them here we have our pictures videos and product descriptions to help you out and find the best fit for you but this right here was a look at the sea sucker palavicini ski and snowboard carrier at eTrailer.com. my name is evangeline and i hope you enjoyed the journey